Hello everyone, welcome again to another series of video from Electronics Eternity. Uh, it's been a while since I made a video, so this will be my first video after a long break. And uh, this time around, we will be looking at uh, ESP8266 uh, Wi-Fi model. So this will be the first of uh, uh, first of like very long series of videos. So uh, let's get right into it. Okay. So in this first part, what I will be covering is on on how to flash this ESP module, right? So I I have this ESP over here. So so it's the usual ESP module. Nothing different about this, right? So it's so just one piece of advice as usual. I would always suggest you guys to get your uh, electronic components from a reliable vendor so that you know you can get support when necessary all right so for this module i got it from a local vendor here in malaysia okay so for the first part what we will be doing is figuring out how to uh, flash this esp8266 okay so as you can see here i got this programmer adapter uh from the same vendor as well so when you buy things from the same vendor they would uh often have the supporting tools for example adapters programmers or, or flashers or logic level converters and etc okay so this is just one of it so how do we uh now how do we stack this on top of this is that we just need to make sure that the orientation is similar right so what you do is just just stack this on top of it and you should get the right uh, arrangement of, of pins okay so then what's gonna happen next is uh, you just have to maybe I can show it over here oh it's outside the window So basically this is my USB hub right so you just plug it in and you just plug it in like this and it will light up okay so let me show you how does it look on the uh, computer side look at the flash uh, software that I have so this software is supposed to update your know, uh, ESP model with the latest flash program so in, in case if you have any problem using your uh, existing uh, esp module you can try flashing it and, and see how it works okay so let's get into it so this uh, entire folder is provided by my vendor so uh, i hope that when you purchase this you purchase from a reliable vendor and they provide you documentation and, and hopefully they provide you uh, softwares that will help you to flash your ESP module okay so this is what I have and this is the program that is supposed to flash my ESP module and uh, I'm gonna have to click OK for this and this is the tool that I have okay so uh, the, the very first thing that I need to do is uh, I need to set the location of uh, where my firmware is going to be found so again it's in the same folder that i have so it's inside this esp at at binaries main and this is the flash file okay so that is the very first setting and for the next part is is to set 0x00 and then uh, it, it's also very important for us to check the right com if we have the right com so one way you can do that is is to open device manager and look for it in the pods okay so let's find the pod so I have this it's, it's quite obvious that this is the one so uh, let me prove it to you so I'm gonna just plug out that that uh, ESP uh, adapter and then I'm gonna plug it again and you can see that there will be a new port detected 
and that will be this COM14. So that's one way you can find out how to identify the COM number, right? So for this, I need to choose COM14, okay? And the next setting would be to set SPI speed, it, which is 40 millihertz and SPI mode, which is DIO, and I need to check this do not change pin. So again, how did I know all this is simply by uh, liasing with the uh, vendor that I purchased this from, right? So uh, they will share the information of this. Uh, to be honest, uh, I'm not really uh, very expert about all these attributes over here, but it, you know, to be safe, you can just follow whatever instruction that they give, okay? So once everything is set, then simply just click start you you will get this download finish and it's all done all right so is is that simple okay so and and with that we have come to the end of the uh, tutorial so if you have any questions uh, feel free to share it below and uh, please like and subscribe that will help my channel to grow uh, until we see you again on the next part of exp uh, videos